And then Sam Bam jumping in with another super. Appreciate you, that, my dog. He says, my week one O-line prediction, barring injury. A left tackle, Bowles. Left guard, Dalton Reisner. Center, Lloyd Cushenberry. Right guard, Quinn Miners. Right tackle, he's talking week one, Billy Turner. Your thoughts on this, and could you see Natani Muti or someone else steal a starting job? I could see it, Zach. I'm not projecting it. I'm not predicting it because I do think – even though Dalton Reisner is under the gun, all right, and he's being challenged, and there's been rumors that the Broncos tried to move him during the draft, he's just not a guy that wilts in the face of challenge or obstacles or adversity, and I think he's going to step up. So left tackle, left guard, I think, is going to look exactly the same as last year. I don't know about center, though. I mean, I, I think it's Cushenberry's job to lose, Zach, when you, you, you sift through what was said about him by coaches and Russell Wilson, and not just said, but like, He's the guy snapping when Russ has had uh, these get-togethers, these throwing sessions. It's Cush out there doing that. But don't sleep on Graham Glasgow. If Graham Glasgow was entering camp like ready to go, like 100% healthy, which he's healthy-ish, but it's similar to like KJ, Zach, where they're going to like ease him into action, right? So that gives another edge to Cush. Miners, same thing. Like he's pretty secure in right guard because Glasgow is not 100% out of the gates. But this does make me cast some doubt on our initial read on right tackle, Zach, because, I mean, Billy Turner, if he's not getting healthy within the first two, three weeks of camp, I don't know, man. That might not – it might be too big of a hurdle to overcome if guys like Tom Compton and or Calvin Anderson in that interim step up to the plate and not only play well but bond with Russ. I agree with everything Sam said there, his prediction. I agree with your analysis, Chad. Uh, One thing I want to add, though, unlike previous years, yeah, the starting five, if this is the starting five, it doesn't look uh, entirely imposing, but for the first time in years, the Broncos have bona fide depth along the front five at different spots. And Tani Muti, Graham Glasgow, uh, Wattenberg, who they drafted, the tackles that you mentioned, Chad. There's a lot of young players to like in the Broncos system, and hopefully under Butch Berry, the new OL coach, they succeed collectively. 